I'm Catherine. I'm here to show you how to purchase a parking permit for the St. Petersburg campus. Parking permits need to be purchased from your home campus, but St. Petersburg campus permits can be used on Tampa and Sarasota campuses in their student parking areas, and permits from other campuses are welcome to park in our green parking. To buy a parking permit if you are a St. Pete student, you would go to the St. Petersburg campus homepage, then to Campus Resources and USF Bookstore, Dining, and Parking. Select Parking and Transportation. You can check out current parking permit rates in the USF St. Petersburg Campus parking brochure linked on this page. If you find you have signed into USF Tampa Campus parking website, there's a link at the bottom of the page that directs to the St. Petersburg Campus parking portal. The parking and transportation page shows our contact information as well as information on parking at the USF St. Petersburg campus. Select Purchase a Parking Permit Online. On this page at the bottom, select Purchase a Permit. If you happen to receive a citation, which we know would never happen to you, this is where you would also pay or appeal it. Sign in with your net ID. If you're living on campus, the permit should show as resident. If you're living off campus, the permit should show as commuter. If you are not seeing either of these choices or the choice is incorrect, please contact Parking Services by phone or email so we can update your account. Permits are prorated the first of every month starting in October. And annual or yearly permits start in August and end in August the following year. If you are only coming to campus for a few times a semester or one time a week, you may want to purchase a daily permit, which you can do from the screen as well. The prices on the page are without tax, which will be added during checkout. Once you select the permit you are purchasing, before checking off the box that you agree to the rules and regulations, open the link and look over the parking brochure. You will need your vehicle information, make, year, and license plate. You can add up to three vehicles. The permits are clean, so they can be removed from vehicle to vehicle, but they are non-transferable to other owners. Whoever the permit is assigned to is responsible for parking of the vehicle. Once you receive the permit, place it on the driver's side lower left corner inside the windshield. If the permit is not placed properly, you can receive a citation. All permits are mailed unless you live on campus. So on the next page, you will add your mailing address. Students who live on campus can pick their permits up at the Student Financial Aid Services office in Bayboro Hall, room 132. You can pay by Visa, MasterCard, Discover, or American Express without any additional fees. If you prefer to pay by check, you will need to either mail us a check or a money order along with the information found on our website. The form is also found on the website and you can visit us at Bayboro Hall. Cash is not accepted. Once your purchase is complete, you will receive a temporary permit that is good for two weeks by mail. If you can print that out and use it until your parking permit arrives in the mail. Happy parking and thank you for watching.